Well, very often we hire the same way we uh, recognize and reward people, which is we only look at their past performance for other companies. You know, we look at their resume. Did you work for my competitor? Do you have the skills? And that's, you know, we, and, and that's basically it. And we've all hired people who were great on paper and great in the interviews, but then when they got to us, it just didn't work. We struggled, even if they were talented. Um, the egos were, were in the wrong place, whatever it was. Um, and so uh, it's just like dating, which is you want to get a sense of someone's character. Um, I'm a great believer that when, if someone is doing well in the interview process, at some point you want to um, go out for a coffee with them uh, socially as part of the interview process, not, not at the office, um, where you don't talk about work or what they've done. You talk about their family and you talk about what they do in their private life and you get to know them. And, and, you, and you start asking yourself, do, do I like this person? Do I want to spend time with this person? Do I, could, I, could I see myself trusting this person? Again, it's a little bit like dating, you know? Um, but I think to, to have some of the more casual interaction is actually very, very revealing. And you get to learn about how someone thinks or treats uh, uh, the people around them. In addition, I think the way we uh, write our want ads, you know, looking for a, uh, an engineer, X amount of years of experience, you know, must know these languages, you know, please apply. Okay, well, that tells us very little about who they are versus uh, saying, describing your culture, right? Uh, if you like working in a team where people take care of each other, um, where people are honest with each other, where we give honest feedback and we like to receive honest feedback, um, you know, uh, we, we may have a, jo a great job for you. Do you know how to code? Do you know how these languages, how, how many years of experience do you have? Please apply. And the point is, is the description of what it's actually like to work there, the description of the culture will immediately turn some people on and immediately turn some people off. And that's exactly what you want. And you want to be brutally honest about what it's like to work there. The good and the bad and the ugly. Uh, because again, uh, uh, that's what they're actually going to experience. Remember, in the interview process, they're selling themselves to us, but we're selling ourselves to them as well. You know, the number of times companies will say, oh, it's, it's like a party here every day. Well, sometimes, and then sometimes it's really like a dungeon, you know? Uh, and I think it's okay to say that. Look, we work really hard and there are days that's sometimes dark, but in the dark days, we're, what you'll find is that we're a culture that takes care of each other. So yes, we have stress, but you'll find that the camaraderie is incredibly high. You know, we can say that as long as it's true, because they're going to find out the truth any moment. Um, uh, uh, so yes, I think we should recruit uh, with honesty and we should recruit to tell people about the kind of conditions they're going to be working and tell them the culture, not just the job requirements.